Okay, now we're going to run live bass through the oven. So we're adding a bunch of, uh, getting a bunch of nice thick low end, bringing out the mids, kind of getting that P bass, you know, mid range, it's great for rock songs. Or we can go the other way and do kind of a scooped mid. So, a couple really useful sounds if we want to go and tighten the low end and just make it more mid heavy, pull down the uh, highs, which will take, take away some of the string buzz. So, a couple really great useful sounds, and we haven't even pushed the unit yet. So now let's uh, let's get some saturation in there. So we get a thicker sound, a driven sound. Uh, we get more clarity on the strings, more mid presence and bigger bass. And uh, you know, I'm surprised in some mixes that are dense, how much high end you have to add to a bass. And what's great about the oven is that we can bring the string noises and clarity out without doing a super big boost of EQ on a parametric EQ. This just is smoother and it's just a better way. Let's hear this one more time. And again, if we wanted to go with a little more mid scoop sound, maybe not as much high end, a little tighter bass. Bass players should put this in their bass rig. <laughs> 